Norvrand is Eorzea. Don't believe me? Okay, well, not literally, but geographically. It's a reflection of the source, after all, so you can overlay it on top of the Eorzean map to see. But let's look at the zones in specific. Lakeland has its large fields, and lake, like Mordona. That's where the Crystal Tower landed where it did, since it's the same place as the source. Amarang is Thanalan, a desert and arid rocky region full of hardy life and mines, with the ruins of an older civilization dotting the landscape. Calusia is Vilbrand, or maybe just Linosia, surrounded by waters and known for its open fields and high cliffs. It's home to a small industrious people and a large mountain at its heart, and Yulmore is quite similar to the aft castle of Limsa, with Thancred even noting the similarities. Ilmeg might at first look a far cry from Curthis, but once upon a time its green alpine heights were a match for the home of Ishgard, and Verber itself in style and substance isn't truly so different, though sadly with less Elizin. Raktika is a forest, like the Shroud. And while the Tempest doesn't match up to any map you know directly, it is essentially the waters beneath the Indigo Deep, which is why the Ando live there, just like the Sahagan. If you knew all this, good for you. If you didn't, then let me tell you that, 